I am back with another makeup tutorial and as you guys know I am a huge revenge fan so if you guys watched my July favorites video I mentioned that I bought the NYX revenge palette and it's beautiful I love it so much isn't the box cute it's so cute I basically bought it for the box anyways so I really wanted to use this palette and I was thinking what can I do it was like a greater good spoke to me well not really basically the palette spoke to me and it's kind of obvious that um, I had to do a look based on one of the revenge characters and who else better to do than Miss Emily Thorne she is gorgeous that's what today's look is inspired by I decided to do her makeup look and I did use the eyeshadows in this palette but if you don't have this palette and you want to recreate this look as well you don't necessarily have to use this so that's that and if you want to find out how to get this look please keep watching so I'm starting off by priming my eyes with the Urban Decay anti-aging eyeshadow primer potion and then I'm taking the pink eyeshadow called Reckoning and patting that all over my lid and also under my eye then I'm taking the matte brown shade in Revelations and I'm just running that through my crease and putting that under my eye as well. Then taking my brown e.l.f. liquid liner, I'm going to line my eyes and I'm using brown because Emily has like a softer look so brown would be very good for that. Also give it a bit of a flick and also line your bottom one-third of the eye and then next take any brown pencil and run that on your waterline and then taking bark from the sleek all natural palette I'm just going to set my liquid liner with that and smudge it out a bit to give it a softer and slightly smoky look and now of course we have to curl the lashes never forget curling my lashes and here I'm just using my CoverGirl Clown Crusher Mascara. But if you have a brown mascara, you can use that as well. But I don't, so I'm using a black one. So that's the eye done. And now I'm just using my Bourjois Chocolate Bronzer to contour and kind of bronze up my face a little bit. And as you guys know, Emily Thorne has amazing cheekbones, so you gotta get that illusion going on that I've got somewhat of a cheekbone and just slightly contour slash brown up my nose so I don't look too pale and then now taking the blush called secrets from the revenge palette I'm just gonna put that on the apples of my cheeks and then using my Mary luminizer just gonna highlight the tops of my cheekbones and just run that under my brown bow. So Emily usually goes for a pinky nude lip. So here I'm using Maybelline's Color Sensational Lip Polish in Glam 1. These lip polishes are also known as the Maybelline Elixirs in other countries. But they're called lip polishes in Asia. I don't know why. And that is the completed look. I didn't really do anything to my eyebrows. I mean, if you want to, just follow your natural shape. And I'm really, really, really excited because Revenge Season 4 premieres tomorrow and we get to see this season in Victoria's point of view. So exciting! And of course, I get to see my Nolan Ross again. Now, wasn't that easy? It was, wasn't it? So I really quite like this look. I think it gives off a much softer look and it's definitely a look that you can wear every day. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'm quite sure it's pretty easy to follow along, right? That's about it. If you like this look and if you love revenge, please give it a thumbs up and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!